Hey guys, so welcome to our channel. So if you don't know me, my name is Gokul and if you are not already subscribed, please make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. Uh, let's get into how you should write your motivation letter and how to make it stand out. Make sure that you do not copy paste anything from the internet. Look at formats, look at ideas, but never copy paste and use somebody else's motivation letter. If you are applying via an agency, I would still recommend you to write your own motivation letter. If the agency is going to help you with the motivation letter and if you if they are going to actually write it for you there's a high chance that uh, the themes and the formats will repeat and the university will kind of understand it's not written by the student themselves so make sure that you write it and I'll tell you exactly how to the first thing to include in your motivation letter is going to be your previous background. So your name, where you're from, what you have studied so far, where you have worked, if you have any working experience. And you can also uh, go ahead and include what program you are applying to currently and in what university. So this should basically be the first paragraph of your motivation letter. In your motivation letter, make sure that you include why you've chosen this particular program, why this particular university and why this particular country. If you're applying to Latvia, make sure you're including why you've chosen to study in Latvia. So all this information is very important for both the university and later the same motivation letter you can submit to the ambassador when you're applying for visa. So it's important for them as well to kind of understand why you are applying and what is the motivation. So go into detail about the university, about the program and about uh, Latvia in general as to what attracts you to Latvia. I mean, most of the common things included are the affordability and the European quality education. If you want to add anything else, of course, you can add it as well. Uh, now, when you go down the rest of the motivation letter, make sure that towards the end of it, you include why you have chosen this particular program in terms of your career going forward. So how this program ties into your previous education and how it is going to help you moving forward and you can go and go into detail about the kind of jobs you are planning to apply for or the career you want to make as well so I hope you guys have learned something new uh, or gained a little more clarity about the situation if you have any questions please make sure you drop it in the comment section below or DM us on Instagram and uh, we will see you in another video very soon take care bye bye